Good afternoon. Welcome to our KRQE.com webcast. I'm Mike Powers. Here's Kristen Van Dyke and the forecast. Another gorgeous day today. Skies partly cloudy out there, just some high thin cirrus clouds, and not going to bring any precip though. We're going to stay rain snow free for today, with a weak disturbance bringing in the chance for a little light snow up in the San Juans and the northern mountains starting tomorrow and continuing through tomorrow night. But we're not expecting a lot of accumulation out of that, and certainly nothing down in the metro area that the winds will be picking up a little bit over the coming days. Temperature wise, highs near 70 today, and then it gets a little bit cooler. Still feeling like spring though. We'll be at 60 degrees tomorrow, and then in the upper 50s. And low 60s for the weekend. Add another black mark to the list of recent problems at the Curry County Jail in Clovis. Detention officer Jaime de la Cruz was charged with bringing marijuana to prisoners in exchange for two hamburgers. Four prisoners and one of their girlfriends were also charged. Jail officials said that surveillance video showed de la Cruz getting a package and the hamburgers from the girlfriend, then delivering them inside that package to an inmate. Drug paraphernalia was seized as evidence along with the uneaten burgers. In Santa Fe, the House yesterday approved a state budget by the narrowest of margins. The $5.4 billion spending plan passed 35 to 34 on an almost party line vote. It's $155 million less than a year ago. It now goes to the Senate. In a separate action, the House overwhelmingly approved a $45 million cap on subsidies for the movie industry. One representative called that a death sentence for the business in the state. That measure now goes to the Senate as well. Stay with KRQE for more news and weather updates throughout the day.